Hey guys, welcome to Premiere Prep, quick and dirty tutorial. I know it's been a while, glad to be back. Hopefully I'll be able to do some more in the near future. Uh, but this is also the first episode in which I'm recording on my new Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K uh, in B-Roll. Okay, so today I'm going to be covering how you can uh, essentially just be able to use external databases for DaVinci Resolve. So say you've got an external hard drive and you want to store your database on here with all your project files and everything, just keep everything nice and neat on an external hard drive or multiple external hard drives, uh, you can do that. One way that I like to do it is when I'm working on a client project or something like that, I'll have an external hard drive, the video files, the graphics, everything is on the external hard drive to include the DaVinci Resolve database. All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. First, you got to plug in the drive. It helps to use a USB 3.0 port. All right, and now next step, we're going to open DaVinci Resolve. All right, so we're gonna come down here to New Database. Click on that, and we're going to go from Disk. We're gonna just name this. We'll call this uh, Resolve HDD. And now it's time to pick a location. You have to actually find the drive on your system. So we're gonna come over here. For me, it's stored underneath uh, where my external hard drives are. And then I've got my Resolve database right here. So this is simply attaching an already created database. All right, and then we'll hit Add. Takes a second, and now here we are with our added database. I've got several projects on here, several client projects and stuff. So that is adding a database, okay? But what if we wanna create a new database? Well, that's very simple. We can come over here and we can hit Create instead of Connect. Now it's gonna be a disk. We're not gonna have an SQL server here. We'll name this test one. And now we will select a directory to save it. And in this case, I would wanna save it, say, to my new, uh, to my external hard drive. So I can come over here and name it resolve db2 and hit choose. And now we will just simply hit create and we now have a new database. And on this database, we can create all of our projects and it'll stay nice and localized there. And now that we've created our database, we can go ahead and make a new project. We'll call this Hello Viewers. And we now have a new project working completely within this Resolve database. Now, the thing that is so awesome about this is I can work mobily on my laptop using external hard drive and everything. And then when I'm, you know, say back at, you know, my main editing rig, my desktop, I can plug in this external hard drive, relink the database, and everything's right there. I will probably have to relink a little bit of media or something like that, but it makes things so much easier. Instead of having project files and all this all over the place, I can have 20 projects on a single database on one external hard drive and it's just so simple. That really is it. There's not much more to go over. Resolve makes it so easy to make databases and store them on external hard drives and stuff. I could even have an external thumb drive. You can back up a database. In fact, let me show you how to back up a database. It's very, very simple. All right, we're gonna come over here. We're gonna right click on our database. Okay, open file location. Okay, so there is our Resolve database file. All we have to do is copy this and then we can go anywhere else we want and paste it, boom, we've just backed up our database. It's literally kilobytes and it can save your butt. I recommend, of course, you don't put it on the same drive, put it on like a thumb drive or something like that on your computer, and you have a complete backup of your Resolve database. It's really easy, so simple, and it can really save your butt to back up your entire database that quickly. I could have had 100 projects right there with just a copy and paste, I've saved my Resolve database. So nice, so simple, so easy. I love DaVinci Resolve. All right, guys, that really wraps it up for this quick and dirty uh, episode of Premiere Prep. Thank you so much for watching. I want to be coming back more and more and more. I've got my new Pocket 4K, which I'm not going to be doing a review of because everybody and their mother has done one now. I'm going to just simply show you guys my setup. And yes, it's pretty great. All right, guys, that really wraps up this episode of Premiere Prep. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to live your life one frame at a time, and I will catch you next time.